Hello guys, today I'm going to show you an elite dribble tutorial for controller, I showcase combos as well. For the first move you're gonna press your arrow key to the opposite hand of the ball, so for me, the right to the left. That's it for the crossover move. The next move is called the hezi, or the hesitation. Basically do the crossover, but keep the ball in your hand. I'll play it in slow motion so you can see. It's not really an effective move, the next move is to step back, it's probably the easiest move in this tutorial. All you do is press this button back. The next move is the behind the back, or the curry slide, it is a bit complicated to explain. Basically move your arrow key to the opposite ball hand, right down or left down. Make sure to move it at the same time. Hopefully it wasn't too difficult to understand. We are now entering the combo or spin move part of the video, please rewind if you still need help with the basics. The first move is the momentum spam. All you want to do is spam the crossover, and if you want you can add a curry slide or a step back. This move will break your opponents easily. It's very simple. The next move is the curry slide spam. All you do is spam the curry slide move. It's not the most useful move, but it will give you a pretty good speed boost. The next move is the moving curry slide. This is probably the most useful move in this tutorial because of the speed boost and how it tricks your opponents. All you do is run while doing the curry slide combo. The next move is the spin move. I don't recommend this move because how hard it is to do, I only have one clip of me doing it. Press up, left, down, or up, right, down. To do this move, the next move is the momentum spam with the curry slide. This combo looks so smooth and has an excellent speed boost if you curry slide out of it. All you do is the momentum spam and then curry slide. Next clip is the cheesy spin move which is the one I recommend because it's not hard at all. All you do is flick your moving stick in a spin motion and then fade if you have the right build. That's gonna wrap up this video. I hope I could help every one of you out. I love y'all. Peace.